Hello, it's Maria. It's Miss Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. Now I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 10, 2 through 9, 2017. The cards I am using today are <laughs> one. <second. laughs> okay. Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out of the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing, and sending up personal readings with me. If you like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with uh, Taurus, 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 Taurus love reading for October 2nd through 9th, 2017. Taurus love reading October 2nd through 9th, 2017. What's going on? Okay. So it seems like somebody is gaining their self-esteem back. I feel like uh, something has been going on, uh, which had you down, like just in your head about what's going on, how you look, what you're doing, you know, and I feel like you're coming out of that. Okay. All right, Taurus, 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 Taurus. Taurus. All right, so it seems like some have kind of weight weight have been lifted off of you, Taurus. What's going on for Taurus? Taurus, Taurus, ten, two through nine, two thousand seventeen. Love. All right, so it seems like um, you starting to see yourself for who you really are. You know, you for a while you was just trying to like you're just living. You just like going day by day, or whatever. You didn't care. You are just trying to make it through the day. But now it's starting to seem like you starting to trying to see trying you're trying to see the reality of things okay so it seems like you may be thinking about something that your ex has done to you or that you've done to your ex maybe you just come into reality about who your ex really was you know i feel like your ex may have taken you to a dark place and now you're starting to see them for who they really are okay so I feel like you're sort of letting go of your ex, you know? All right. So, yeah, it seems like this person has some kind of power over you. They was, um, it seems like they might have been using your uh, self-esteem to um, control you. Control you. But I feel like, I really feel like you out of this, um, you're out of this loop now. Okay, Taurus. All right, so yeah, it seems like they might have been using your baggage against you. Like, I don't know, maybe you might be a little heavier or maybe a little slimmer or maybe you have kids or maybe you just have debt. But it seems like this person was trying to grab whatever they could to um, to make you feel like that you weren't good enough, but you let, you're letting it go now. now. That's a good thing. Yep. There we go. Yeah, I feel like you are letting this go. you like, I, I don't know if you guys are still together. No, it's your ex. So it's like you letting go of the hold. you letting go of the hold that this person then had on you. I feel like for some of you, it's months or years. I don't know the number nine. I don't see it out there anyway. But that number keeps showing up in my head. So you could have been together for nine months, nine, you know, nine something. Okay. Nine months, nine years, nine days. I just keep seeing... The number nine, so mm, maybe that's what the X is. No, the X is four, okay. So maybe something, okay. All right, yeah. So, yeah, you came in out of a feeling of being like, um, I'm, I'm not gonna say sorry, but feeling like sad about your situation. You pissed off now, you mad at what this person done to you anger and it seems like um it seemed like you got friends they 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 talking about the whole situation i i think they talking about like how um i'm gonna say i'm not mean you got they talking about how mean you got but it's like i don't know i feel like it's just light lightweight talking okay I don't know. They probably trying to get you to do crazy stuff too. So it's like, uh, don't listen to any more negativity. 
Like, don't end up in jail. <laughs> Please. I know it's easy when you realize you've been bamboozled. All right, yeah, so the Ten of Cups here, I mean, I feel like you, you're you on your way to find happiness, but it's after this anger. After the anger passes, you'll be fine. You know? All right, what's going on for the Taurus? Taurus, Taurus. Taurus love reading for October 2nd through 9th, 2017. Oh, yeah, you're going to be pissed off. I mean, you are. You are pissed off about what happened. Everything. So I feel like some trips were made. I feel like, yes, yeah, somebody, you might have took some uh, time off, went on a trip. Everything was happy. You was working hard, spending a lot of uh, money on this trip. And this person was supposed to, sorry, this could be a whole nother story. Somebody was supposed to pay you for this, and they didn't. All right, so give me some cards. Four. Jeez. All right. So, I feel like some of you guys probably lost your job or um, just got a, a new start. All right, what's going on, Taurus, 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 love reading. All right, Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Here you got all the stuff trying to drop out. Jeez. Jeez Louise. All right, yeah, so not coming together, no understanding in this situation. Mm. Yeah, you was done wrong. Like, I was done wrong and that's it. You know, I don't want to hear nothing else about it. Mm. So, for some of you, this person actually moved out after they um, did what they did. They, they just was uh, using you, making you feel like nothing, taking your money, and then they moved out. Okay, so if you don't know this, you're going to. All right, so we got the two of cups first. Cups, cups, cups. Two. All right, the two of cups is reversed. It says, um, this is a card of union of two people coming together at a time of understanding the two. So, huh? I don't know. I guess the understanding is you mad and you know the other person did you wrong. I mean, they know they did it. They probably just trying to act like they didn't. All right, so we got the justice card reversed. So, and that says injustice and failed agreement. So, this could be somebody just moving out. Like, they leave you with all these bills after y'all came from a trip, and then they just dipped out. So, Six of Swords says, it's reversed. It says, a statement of position, revelation of non-private disclosure. So, you guys may end up in court after this situation. Yeah, because I feel like you're going to be trying to get money back or something back from this person. They're going to be like, nah, you know, you didn't say this. You know, trying to do a little beat around the bush or find ways out of it, you know. So we got the moon card. The moon. All right, the moon says, lies and deception, confusion. I mean, confuse your options. Watch for friends who are, in fact, enemies. Uh, there is gossip surrounding the situation. Events become very crazy. This makes me feel like your friends, these buddies up here, they um, they know a lot more and knew a lot more than what's going on. I feel like they, you might find out all this this week. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.